Yo, what is going on, everybody? I'm Past Two, and this is part three to my advanced Takeda V1 combo guide. Okay, so jumping right into this, I want to show you the main combo we'll be learning. That being this right here. <laughs> Okay, so to start this out, uh, if you've watched part one and part two, then you have an understanding of how this combo works already. Uh, in order to get this infinite down, something I recommend practicing is just doing sliding uppercuts over and over in pre training. So if you can get to the point where your sliding uppercuts look like that until you're out of stamina, then you can maintain that speed while you're doing the infinite to continue this combo. So what I recommend doing to practice for this is you would do three sliding uppercuts, and on the third sliding uppercut, you would do a jump LMB midair. So one, two, three, jump LMB. And once you get that rhythm down, you can go for that same combo. Looking like... One, two, three, jump LMB, F, one, two, three, same thing, jump LMB, F, one, two, three, you're out of F, so you end up with the blink strike. Okay, for this next part, you have to learn another somewhat advanced grapple combo. I really think this is more intermediate, but basically you just uppercut, you time your grapple, and then you uppercut again, and you hold W when you're in the air, and you hit L and B. So it would look like this. Uppercut, hold W, air L and B. One more time. You would... Uppercut, grapple, uppercut again, hold W, air LMB. Okay, why I wanted to show you this is whenever you are in your ult and you haven't won neutral but you still have all of your Fs, you could run towards somebody and hold blue focus to close the distance. And once you're very close to them, you could use your F Grapple, time your uppercut, air LMB, F, and then you can start that same infinite where you do three sliding uppercuts, jump up, and you hit up, and you have them in a loop. So, that's opener one. Okay, for the second opener, this is actually one of the more technical combos to do in the game so don't feel too bad if you can't actually do this one right away this took me lots of hours of practice to get down but you're only gonna have to do this one time the original combo for heaven's death looks something like this okay so you're basically just uppercut grappling and then timing your sliding uppercut again instantly off your grapple but for this combo I just want you to understand that mechanic, so you're going to throw your F out, you're going to do a sliding uppercut into another sliding uppercut. See right there, you've seen I messed it up. It's because this input is very strict. I'll try it again. You would throw your F out, sliding uppercut, into another sliding uppercut, jump L and B, F, and now they're in a loop. And say you're playing F2, you could extend it even further. And maybe even go for the actual heaven step. Like that. And finish the combo however you want. That's opener two. Okay, for opener three, if you go into your button layout and remap, you want to make sure you have sheath weapon on something that's more accessible. By default, I believe this is on zero. I have mine on caps lock. So... After you do a sliding uppercut, you can grapple, switch to unarmed, and land a unarmed combo. One, two, three. Why this is good is if you are 
Data, you can use this as a way to open up somebody for an infinite. So you would throw your F, go in for the sliding uppercut, do the unarmed one, two, three. Right there, you saw I dropped it. We'll try it again. Pop to unarmed, one, two, three. Catch them up. Yeah. Now I have them in an infinite that I could have looped had I had another F. Okay, that's opener three. Okay, now getting into your parry combos off your ult. You could jump L and B off the second hit. F into three sliding uppercuts. Into a jump L and B. And you get that loop to start the infinite we just learned. First hit of the counter, you could jump an ult. And you could start an infinite the same way. Like so. Something else you could do if your ult isn't already activated. Then you land a parry, you could cancel out, sliding up or cut, ult, and start an infinite the same way. Okay, so if you've made it this far, I want to say thank you for watching, and hopefully you've learned something new from at least one part of these this three part series if you'd like to see more videos like this let me know i want to try to get more consistent on youtube again and just upload as many mechanics or tips videos as i possibly can just so we have that info out for the community uh i'm gonna show you one last combo to finish this video off of like all the mechanics we've learned thus far and how you can string them together and get creative and maybe make your own combos all right, take care, everybody. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> Shit! <laughs>